Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today I will show you guys how to customize the charging sound and also the animations when charging your iPhone on iOS 17. Now, of course, Apple won't allow us to do that, change the charging sound or even add any animations while charging, but we have a few options which actually allow us to do that and it's pretty effective. Now, when it comes to sounds, you can use custom sounds or some speak text or things like that and it won't have any impact on your device, but if you use the animations, of course, they will have a bit of impact on the battery life so i wouldn't suggest that you use them all the time you can try them out or just use them time after time but i wouldn't suggest that you keep those on all the time now let me show you guys how to do that first of all when it comes to charging sounds what you can do is just head on to google and search for royalty free charging sounds and you will find a bunch of them like right here on pixbay you will find some pretty cool ones these are royalty free which means that you can download and use them on your device and you will have a bunch of different sounds here you will have a download button which you can tap and this will download them to your device so we tap download here of course they will be saved on the downloads folder on the files app now here's what you need to do head on to your files app and find the sound that you have just downloaded make sure if you if it actually doesn't have the name you want it to have it has like a large name like this one right here just change the name so let's just change the name to tone here because we need this name to actually th set this up as a sound for when we charge our iPhone. So let's just name this tone. So it's tone.mp3, tap done here. And now what we need to do is head onto the shortcuts app. And from here, make sure you go to automations, tap on new automation, and then go and find charge here. Make sure you tap on run immediately and you have this disabled then tap next what you need to do now is tap here on new blank automation and search for get file and you will find this right here get file from folder tap on it and here where it says shortcuts tap on it and find here your downloads folder on the files app and then tap on open and it will switch here to downloads then here you need to type the name of the sound file that we just downloaded in this case is tone.mp3 now, once you have added the name of the file that you have downloaded, what you need to do is tap here and search for play sound and you will find play sound here. Just tap on it and now you're good to go. Tap the dumb button and now you have this automation created that will play that sound whenever you're plugging your device to charge. So let's just try it out. And as you can hear right there, once it's plugged in and it starts charging, it will actually play that sound. The next thing you can do is make your iPhone speak some text when you plug in your device to charge. And that's very easy to do. Tap on new automation here on the shortcuts app. Again, go to charge and then tap on run immediately right here. Make sure you have this also disabled. Tap the next button and search for speak text. Once you find speak text, on what it says right here where it says text tap on it and just enter anything you want your iphone to say so let's just type here iphone charging once you have done that just tap the dumb button and that's it you're good to go so let's just plug in the device to charge And just like that, it will speak and it will say that the iPhone is charging. Pretty cool, right? This is how easy you can do that. You can speak any text or add any tone you want for when you plug in your iPhone to charge. And now let's talk about animations. Now, when we're talking about animations, you will have to download third party apps, which will add these kind of really cool animations. You can see right here, we have a bunch of really cool animations from this app, which of course I will leave linked right down below in the description of the video. Now, the way this works, basically you select here what animation you wanna use. So if I wanna use this one, I just select it here, get out of the app, and then head on to the shortcuts app, new automation right there, and then go again to charger, make sure you tap on run immediately, tap the next button, and then just search for here for new blank automation, tap on open app, and just choose the app, which again is called animations right here, and you're good to go. You tap the dumb button, and just like that, once you plug in your device to charge, it will actually show you that cool animation.
and as you can see right there it's showing that animation now the bad thing here is that if you leave your iphone like this it won't actually consume a lot of battery because you can see right here most of the screen will be black which means that it's turned off so it's not consuming a ton of battery but what someone can do here is if you leave your iphone like this is just swipe up and get into your device and i will show you guys how to actually lock your device when you're having these animations being played so that's actually pretty simple to do but let me show you guys a couple of other apps which you can use for animations which are actually really cool one of them will be this app called fluid which is actually pretty awesome now the, again this works the same way you simply create a new anim automation right here again go to charger run immediately tap the next button new blank automation and right here on on open app select the app so you will find fluid right here tap the dump button and you're good to go now once i plug in my device again to charge i will get that really nice animation on my device so you can see how cool that looks so you will have this screen which you can basically play around with and it looks pretty awesome now the same thing goes for another app now this app is called triple a again you you just create actually you create the same like automation just like you did with fluid and the other app and you have this app launch whenever you're plugging your device to charge and it looks something like this you can see these cool animations you tap on the three dots there if you want to change them you can see how cool that looks and you can actually enable auto here which makes this just like play automatically and you will have this cool cool looking screen whenever you're charging your iphone it's pretty awesome now as i said this is the bad thing about this is that someone can just swipe up get out of the app and get into your device if you just leave your iphone like this but what you can do is head on to your settings go under accessibility here and make sure you swipe all the way down go to guided access and make sure you have guided access enabled you set a passcode here and you enable face id as well now all you have to do now is head on back to shortcuts here and go to automations now you choose which app you want to use of course in this case if we're using fluid you can just go ahead and create a new automation right here and then go to app and then right here tap on run immediately and you choose when it's open you choose the app here let's just choose fluid just like that tap the dumb button and tap next now what you need to do here is tap on new blank automation and search for guided access and here we have start guided access we tap on it tap the dumb button and we're good to go now every time someone will oh actually every time this app launches of course when we plug in our device to charge you can see what will happen it will actually open the app but at the same time we'll start guided access which means that the screen now is locked on that app and someone gets here tries to get out of the app and into the home screen they won't be able to do it the only way is for you to actually just double tap on the side button there and use your face id to actually unlock your device and that's the way you can protect your device while actually using one of these apps so that's pretty much it for this video guys this is how you can create custom charging sounds and custom animations for your device running ios 17. hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did smash the like button subscribe if you want to see more ios 17 videos and i'll see you on the next one